Unakosea, eh. jina kubwa na niuliza, Mr. Boy tayari ulipokuja inda vyuka jo, Mr. Boy ni star. Mi, mina kujaka. What's up my people, welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is Empire Group Productions and I'm your host Wanji Olasa and behind the camera I have my director and that is King Trevor. So with us here guys we have Mr. Boy. Yeah. Saki kumpea titles mingi mingi nataka atuambia yege ni nani. Mr. Boy kwanza, uko aje? Niko fresh kama kawa, unawani cheki? Eh, yeah, naona uko sawa kabisa. Na pose luku nini? Ha. Nyesha niko fresh, yo? Aya. Yeah. Atuko ni ambewe ni msani, we ni entapredua, we ni nani? Aya. Kama msani. Expensive ember msani no check. Hey. And the most expensive artist in this 254 yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, you are into music. I'd love to know where this you know music journey started. Music nianza kitambo sana. Nikiambia watu wengi mara nyingi kufikiria ni cloud. Wengi wanafikiria eh age ya mtu wa ndani na muziki wake. Muziki nianza 2013 I think so. 2011 2013 yeah. Hapo ndo ulitoa ngoma yako ya kwanza. Of course yeah. Like uh, you know I fully processed ngoma. Nyimbo nzima audio mpaka video. Ilikuwa inaitwa jamu unaweza tuimbie hiyo wimbo yenyewe. Nyimbo ilikuwa inaitwa nieleze. Mhm. Mm. Hebu imbe. Mm. <laughs> Tafadhali nieleze mami nikajue kosa langu kwa nyumba umenuna. Unielezi ni kosa lipi? Tafadhali nieleze mami nikajue kosa langu kwa nyumba umenuna. Unielezi ni kosa lipi? Mekutosha bana. Ah uh, mimi nataka kujua what maybe inspired you joining music. Ah uh, mimi mwenyewe ni msanii. Mm -hmm. Ah familia yangu ni kisanii. Mm -hmm. Na mimi mwenyewe kusimama kwangu usanii. Kuvaa usanii, kusimali usanii. Kila kitu familia yangu ni usanii, mimi ni msanii. So mimi mimi nilipenda muziki na nikafanya muziki. Nilipozaliwa nilikuwa na sakata rumba. Eh? Zakina papa wamba za zamani basi na mimi kama na muziki hivyo nikakuwa msanii mbaya sana. And maybe mimi ningetaka kujua hapo mbeleni shida kubwa before you joining the music industry what was the main problem that you may be facing? Ah uh, ile time you to think sana in face eh kuachwa promoters kunyima stage uh, producers kutonitilia manani when you interviews at TV station, I face a lot of things, but I'm not part of music, yeah. yeah. And fast forward to you, that the artist you are right now. Nini sasa, uneza sama nini mefanya, you are very different na watu wengi pia si tumekuja kutafta interview ya Mr. Boy. Uneza sama nini, what makes you different? Many more expensive, sana. Sana. Oh, can you know that you expensive? Watu wengi sana mbao menefanya interview, wengi sana menefanya for long sana. Wengi sana. Na siya tini mekata interview. Sometimes pia ni lazima unajua vile tu nyinyi expensive exp, ni embara embara ni watu expensive that people can chew them unaona yeah. sawa ni embara lakini umetoka tu pale mtaani na mike yako tu mbili unakuja kutafuta clout na mimi usiwezi nitafuta vizuri tufanye interview kama wewe unavyo nitafuta hiyo nitafuta poa sana tu mimi nibaye chai huko poa una class you go to the driver interview poa I I love I don't okay, you've done a a song with um Buzi Gang in it was Peketu right? Yeah my god. Eh mimi ningetaka kujua how was that for you? Ah nyimbo ilikuwa poa. Lakini sikuwa nimejua vibe ya genga tu sana. Leno sumbua kidogo lakini mimi najua mimi ni mtu I'm a songwriter too. I'm an artist so nilitafuta vibe eh nika producer akapiga beat nika flow. Mimi nikamaliza lakini wao kidogo najua wale wamezoea zile beats za kadu. So it was sumbo kidogo lakini watu kama kina Jofes sio Jofes ni anafanya na pia kama spoken word kwake alikuwa rais kidogo lakini wengine pia ile wasumbo kidogo And uh, okay what type of music do you produce jumesema wewe na gengeton kidogo Mimi uh. nafanya swahili flavor muziki swahili muziki mzuri muziki wa familia muziki mama anaweza sikiza mtu anaweza sikiza baba anaweza sikiza lakini kuna nyimbo nikirekodi kuna under 18 unaweza watch Na mlipata naje na mbuzi gang na mkamua you know let's do this thing you produce this song ni nini ilifanya mpatane ama ah, mbuzi gang si atini ilifanya ikapatana wakati mwa corona hivi zilikuwa kibao so walikuwa wametoa shamra shamra iko kwa market so mimi na mimi nikapenda vibe eh. so nilipopenda vibe nikasema ah ama boys let's do something nikatuma management yangu na ma bado nikaona ma presenters eh kikosi yangu bado nikaona ma presenters wengi sana haya nikatuma kina kaka jiki na nani wote wakaenda kumcheki Alafu alipocheki basi ndio tukapata na Jofes Jofes akasema aka producer wake ni Kashkid sasa tukaenda kwa Kashkid Kashkid akafanya nyimbo 
Uh, sir, I love who, how would you describe the music industry as it is as right now? Music is so sweet, like in Haina competitors. Na industry, sasa? Industry mzime melala. Kwe, sababu napata msani, anatoka Nigeria in upcoming. Ana nyimbo moja, ana boom Kenya in a hit. Msani anatoka bongo, ana nyimbo moja, ana boom in a hit. Lakini napata msani mkubu, alifanya alba, na kalala, back to back afanyi. So napata wale wa sani wa inji, mtu kama maybe Ibra, amepiga ipi, ya nyimbo kama kumi. Tumulingasha na msani amefanya nyimbo moja, honestly. Haitaweza, Rayvana mekoje na album, dewe wa marimix na pigu, marimix na pigu. Kenya tumelala, kweli tumelala. Sikufichi, lakini misi jalala, mimi nimetoa ipi kubwa. Kubwa, na mimi na shuti na directors wa kubwa sana. Yeah. Na ni mwana unaperform kwenye event ya Gucci. Mm -hmm. What are we supposed to expect from you today? Uh, mazinga umbwe, mm -hmm. uh, mazigizaka. Zuna jomu expensive lazima majipangi vila na ingia stage kusumbua. Yeah. Eh, security kibao. Lazima, lazima yaani tu faifu, ijo kwa makuna, iko, wazazi wajua mwilea watoto expensive. Watoto nye US kieta na ita mtoto ni expensive. Iwe ni kekuja in approach umu tu ni expensive. Si msani umetoka pale na yafo zinanuko na inge stage. Lazima inge ki expensive. Nani alewa? So kinge hivu, tayari fan base yako itakujua kama expensive artist. Promoter ki kuhost show, maybe ya mekuita Nigeria, South Africa, Cuba, Dubai, ana ita kama msani expensive. Nani alewa? Kuna msani hapa tu faifu, wajai wana ata Tanzania. Walai na kufichi, si kufichi. Tanzania wajai wana. Lakini njimbo zazi na chuzo kwa TV rupi na pigwa. Sasa ndo mana, people they have to work. They have to work on their, their brand. Mr. Boy, apart from music, ni nini ingine unafanyanga? Cause, hii oh. maisha yako pia, it's questionable. Ni music inalipa hizi build? Ah, mziki, mziki sa hizi. Hmm? Mziki nafanya na passion. Eh, mi ni expensive. Mi ni businessman. Eh? Ukingia kwa bayo wangu, unajua the expensive jungle emperor. Mm -hmm. Instagram, sinu wacheki. Ata YouTube, bayo yuko na hile? Bayo, sinu wacheki. So mimi, mimi ni expensive, mimi nafanya biyashara. Nafanya kila biyashara, biyashara ambazo ni nzuri, legit. Uh, true business. Next time nuzani pata na deal na lands, nuzani kuta na deal na maji, nuzani deal na brandings, endorsements. So, mimi si msani ule wa show, unajua mara mingi ni kifanya interview, that's why nukupangu kifanya interview. Niki sema kitu kwa interview, watu nasema uongo. Wenye wana niku, gare zangu nasema, eh, kweli ni kweli. Wana nukuta ni kina pawasu na sweat. Na pika zile endozi mendoona mimi, eh nyo Mr. Boy ni wakujetuma, si cloud, I'm not a cloud chaser, I'm a real man. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you've said you started your music journey in 2013. Kitambo, ulikuwa mzaliwa? Nilikuwa mtoto kidogo, lakini nilikuwa ni mzaliwa. Imagine size unifanyi interview. Basi, ndomana nukwambi wa ni expensive. Kufanyi ya mzee mkongwe wa game, interview, na 2013 ukuwa mzaliwa, ae. Uko sawa. Ae, sami nataka kujua, kwa ni 2013, how old are you? 2013? Twenty-three, you're going to be young. You're going to be young. Mama, say you're going to be young. Twenty-three. No, this is twenty-two. How old are you right now? I'm twenty-four. Now, so twenty-thirteen. You look how old? My young, you look around thirteen, fourteen. Now, but upon the lands of Sunny. Of course. Okay, that's yes. interesting. As long as you mean that you want to go, ah, you want to learn your music, you want to learn your music. You want to video, honestly. Unajua angalia kazi, mm -hmm. si cloud papa, hapa ni unaniuza vitu live. Angalia class, ni meshuti, na pinimiti na mtu kama Vani Boy, nenda Wasafi, nenda South Africa, nenda Dubai. Nanyelewa? Si lazima tenyujisho kwa kamera, eh, eh, hapana. Mi ni vile sipendi, lakini kama kenya nataka nionekana. Aki nenda kuonekana, mm -hmm. eh, nenda kuonekana. Tukungoje? Ah. Alafu, wasani unogopa kuspendi kwenye video zao. Nanyelewa? Mi utoboka. Mi neza toboka mbaka uhai kurisk na risk mbaka uhai sababu nataka kitu nzuri kitu mamangu akicheka na wewe mwanangu wa da ume invest sasa video ikitoka pale mchezo mgani atacheza hakuna hmm? Nairobi boss Nairobi gospel wa kicheki tu hivyo anaacha ah Mr Boy amaachia wanasukuma Nairobi gospel ah ni wapoa sana wana support talent hata nyinyi manzemu na sub fanya kitu kubwa sababu wasani wa Kenya hata msipoenda kwa milango sasa yeye hata mwingine analala hana food unga imepanda mafuta imepanda hana fare na kesho anataka kusema mziki Kenya ilipi? Kenya watu wao ni wasanii kwa kitu na umelala. Haiwezi, haiwezi. Na tunasema tunachao wasani wakubwa ndio wanakula hapa mbele. Mbona mimi nakula niendesha magari kubwa kubwa? Unielewa? Na mimi sichezi kama wasanii wengine at rotation kila mara. Mimi sipigi rotation lakini na drive. Unielewa? Mm -hmm. Sababu unajua kitu nataka. Mimi nikif... nikisukuma kazi yangu pale Spotify, nikisukuma boom play, kazi yangu iko fresh. Singangani na hizi vitu Hati siju ni kosa nani na promoter de jamani nyima shwa pana. Promoter na vuna mpambeleza ni pesho. Yes. 
And kuna mahali nimesikia wewe you have a family and kids. Mimi nataka kukusikia more about that. Family haji. Unajua kuna family planning. Kuna family plan so sielewi. Familia. Kuna family bank eh. Kibanga pale tunaweza ongea vibaya sana. Hapo tutaongea. Na hela mimi. Ay ay ay. Mimi nataka kujua family like a family unit, a wife and children. Unit haji. Kati? Unit haji and sielewi. Family unit. Si unit na zende ni chaevo ni pe unit ya familia. Aya, nakuuliza wewe do you have a wife? Eh? Uko na bibi? Sawa. Nikuulize. Si unauliza unit? Eh, wewe ni usoneno mimi ni wa unit. Ama mimi nakao kuzingua. Nauliza a family unit. Are you part of a family unit? You know nuclear family. Oh. Nuclear. Mimi niko scattered. Eh sababu generation yangu ni manzi mimi mwenyewe. Babangu hajaanzisha mimi mwenyewe nikatupa bullet. Eh. Yeah. Sasa mimi niko scattered. Siko nuclear. Uko kwa ah, nuclear family. Uh, Staki nuclear. Uko na watu hii. Ah! Ukiniangalia unaona wewe oh, mwenyewe tukiona. Ukiona okay, tu rumors unaona nini wewe? Mimi rumors zinasema uko na watoto. Wengi sana. Sikufichi. Serious. Ah, mimi sipendi kuzimbona nizingue. Hata niseme kweli mimi na watoto sita. Moja moja mpaka sita. Sita. From the wasichana watatu, ndume tatu. From the same lady. Na watoto wote ni chupa. Chupa yani mimi natoa chupa. Mm. Haya basi sasa sasa na sasa kwa hivyo uko na watoto na pia sasa oh. Enjoy. Sasa hizi sasa hizi unajua nimekawia sana sijazao mwaka. Sasa so, unapiga plan ya next year. Niune kama kuna mtu kwa hii baridi tunaweza pata mtoto. Mimi ni responsible father. Unanielewa? Mtoto anapozaliwa lazima nimtafutie kambuni ya kumraise itamfunza atavaa aje gari. Mtoto mtoto wangu hizi kwa matatu ama kwa basi ya shule. Apelegwe na gari arudishwe you unanielewa know, mimi si zaidi tukuzaa na zaki plan eh? alafu naangalia mama mwenye pia ni kamera unanielewa you know, sababu tutazaa kitu si kamera lazima kamera ndio mtoto akishukishwa shule wanacheki eh, eh, wengine waliomba sisi tulikuwa tunafanya nini mm-hmm. eh, na si kuomba ni bidii kwa smart haya mimi smart tulianza mambo ya watoto lini sasa hivi uko 23 eh, 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 acha tu acha ni acha ile hiyo story tena na eh unajua eh. mimi na kuangana one chenye Mungu amenibariki amenibariki na mbegu. Unaelewa? Mm-hmm. One bullet. Mm-hmm. Na pigipiga moja hivi. Mm-hmm. Ana sihitaji kwenda titano sita, moja. Hey, imetosha. Moja tu peke yake. Mm-hmm. Ndaa ya mtoto. Aki ya Mungu. Wallahi billahi. Na sikia tena nimeoja siku zake. Mimi bullet tu na nta. Mm. <laughs> so next year tutafaa tuongee tutafaa tuongea hey, generation. Naongeza bwana naongeza naongeza mtoto mimi na misi mtoto na misi. Na misi, mimi na misi. Utaongeza wangapi? Watoto Mungu akinijalia kama atanipa nguvu sana mimi naweza hata hata Mungu akinijalia naweza kufikisha 100. Hai Mr. Boy, mimi watoto 100 na hii economy. Sisa, economy nini? Economy nini? Eh. Mtoto nikiweka mimba lazima ni kuwa na project kama ni duka hivi naianzisha duka. Eh. Hii duka naweka pale mfanya kazi namwambia hii ni ya mtoto. Investment hakuli. Akikula kifungo. Kila mtoto na investment. Eh, kuna shamba, kuna yule nimekea duka, kuna yule nimeinvest kwa safari kom. Airtel kuna ile nime invest kwa Telkom kuna ile nime invest kwa Lands kuna ile nime invest kwa shops za kawaida mm-hmm. kuna ile nime invest kwa manguo so kila mtoto ana bidhaa zake unanielewa so akitoka pale mimi pesa zangu zenye nakula za mchongo tu yani natulia tu hivi yani unanielewa kutulia tu nakula na mama mazi eh? wanakula vizuri wanavaa wa mama mazi wewe ushaisikia ushaisikia eh? mtu yote nimezaa naye ameweka kwenye social media ati kwamba Mr. Boy yako responsible na sasa tukipata after hii video eh lakini mimi napofanya kila video naachwa kwa nini? Sijui. Nasipigi kiki, na si atanimeguza yule model ama nimeenda kuchiti. Kile napotufanya nyimbo tu hivi, video mpya hivi. Naachwa. Kwa hivyo sasa ni kuoga, kurudi soko very fast. Lakini this time ni sijui nani, sijui hao ma comedian pia wanatafuta. Kuna comedian alinicheki, niliweka status nika delete. Sasa nilipoweka nili nili niliachwa in one hour. In the next two hours nilikuwa na mrembo. Aje sasa. Ah, mimi mwenyewe ni public figure. Naweza katia mtu kweli? Sasa u... Sina time ya kukatia mtu mwenye ana check. Mimi si responsible hata zao watoto 100. Hata sasa hivi nimekuwa kwa kule mtu mwingine ananiambia tu kuna watoto 500. Mimi nataka kuzana wewe. Ala. Sababu unajua mimi unajua kwa nini mimi? Mimi naomogopa kuwa responsible. Anasema uchumi, nikuulize kuna nje ambazo vitu zimepanda bei. Na nielewa? Yeah. Hawalalamiki. Mbona si tulie? Tuje tu umetukubali matokeo. Taifa lina loan sasa kwa hivyo wewe uko sawa na bei za unga na bei za unga ikifika 500 eh. na bora najituma silali. Mm-hmm. Kwa tu sawa. Si tuna unga ikipanda tunaenda kwa mchele. 
Tuache kushinda hapo. Eh hey, bana mnazingizia unga unga unga. Imetanamshwa shilingi mbili. Unajua shilingi mbili ni nyingi sana. Mbili na bado mtu anasema eh shilingi mbili tu. Angalia ule mtu ata, kesho atakwambia mimi nataka maendeleo. Hapana mm-hmm. wale ndio watajagoa yajakoa. Miss Boy, maybe as we wind up, we met on base of stories about me want you to advise that young person who want to, en- to enter into this music. Yaani utamwambia nini? Cuz hii yeah. mziki bana. Yeah. Watu wamejaribu na wao. Sio kwanza anafanya nini? Hatari. Sio dozi sio discourage. Lakini utamwambia nini? Waambie tu kitu yani encourage someone. So usitai usha discourage watatu pale. Aje. Hiyo ni N, unajuaje nimetoa nyimbo inaitwa Maybe ni hit nimetoa ya. Producer amepiga. Ni creativity. Hit inaenda hiyo. Unielewa? Sija mdiscourage wasanii wajitume alafu wa invest. Usingeenda si kama university. Usingeenda si mikono mitupu. Unaweza kuwa mkali unaweza imba mpaka yani mtoto wenyewe akikuona tu ngozi zinararuka tu zenyewe. Lakini kutoka tu faifu ni noma. Lazima uinvest kwa kazi yako. People want to see video ni clear. They want to see the quality audio. They want to see the quality life of an artist. Presenter atakuja kwako maybe kuku zinatoka toka nje. Unielewa? Mm. Punda zimezunguka pale mbuzi zina, zinaendaenda kama ni kijiji. Hapana, ifu na kaple artist. Artist ni kiocha jamii, msanii ni kiocha jamii. Mm. Unielewa? Lazima ukue kio. Usitumbie pale umengara na tukikupata kwenye ma live. Uwi, Mungu wangu. So lazima pale kwa live uko umengara na um, na pia kwa muziki umengara. Ni poa. So wa invest, invest bro, sister. Invest. Bure utatumiwa Tufaifu, tufaifu. Hata nyuma unaweza tumiwa. Tufaifu si kuzuri. Si kuzuri. wapi? Nyuma. Ha. Kweli, mimi nakwambia ukweli hapo. Nyuma wapi? Mm? Mm. Ah nyuma. Nyuma tu. Ah nyuma tu. Nyuma sereka, nyuma tent. Haya <laughs> sawa bana. Sawa usipo, usipo jituma, hauna chochote. Hauna pesa hata yule mtu. Unajua yule mtu wa nyuma mm. akiwa amekuja for example kuna 100,000. Unanielewa? Mm. Na yana ona na invest 50,000. Hawezi kuambia vitu za nyuma. Harajo eh hey, umseni expensive. This nigga needs investment. Lakini umekuja eh brother, najua mimi nimegonga out hapo bana. Nimepiga. Ndio hiyo cheza. Wapi? Harakwambia oh, bro, tunapanganga hivi, tunapanga hivi. Naishi naishi Karen. Come visit me. Na hivyo ndio wenda ukao. Alafu mm. Mr. Boy, ambia watu pale kwenye wanaweza kupata kwenye YouTube, Instagram hizo. Na sasa tukisiwa tanisumbua. Hautaki wakutafute. Mimi nasumbuliwa. Eh. Wewe ni Benjamin pia nimekusumbua kunitafuta. Eh, by the way umenisumbua sana. Wewe unakuacha kabisa. Si si. Unanielewa? Eh. Sipendi watu wanijue. Eh. eh, na unajua kuna mtu maybe hajakuja ku support Mr. Boy. Kuna yule amekuja tu kunitafuta maneno. Unielewa? Kuna ujuzi mwingine akaniuliza Mr. Wewe ulifanya interview na Tumbili ukasema una watoto sita. Mbona kwa kwa Instagram yako hajapost watoto. Instagram ni ya biashara. Watoto wangu watafanya ni kwa biashara zangu. Lakini kwenye status za WhatsApp watoto wapo wapo live wana check wana nice na watoto mimi kwanza siwezi feature demo ikikuja mwambie I'm father of six except me leave me niache ni rori na watoto sasa nikipiga bibi mama wangu mimi nitaenda kwenye yangu yes eh ayo basi miss boy sasa umekataa kuambia watu kwenye watakupata kuhusu kunipata eh mziki wako pia nyimbo zangu zote ziko kwenye Spotify naitwa Mist boy M I S T boy ni B O O Y na kwenye mtandao wa Instagram naitwa Mist Boy. Na utapata Mist Boy wengi but angalia the official ukiona tu sura hii inakaa filter imeoshwa. Jua si mimi. Lakini yenye nakaa profile ya camera K Magic K Vish wamepiga jua tu huyo ni Mist Boy live. Unanielewa? Utapata pale Mr P ameuaua vitu zake pale. Ukiona mtu mwenye Mr P amefollow mm, King Trevor amefollow tu mbili kina Jalan kina Bina. Jua ni mimi. Ukiona kufollow machizi uibiwe pesa zako is upon you. Follow me ni Mist Boy. M I S T and I'm not a cloud chaser. I'm a real me. Period. Yeah. Ah yes. Yeah. So, Hapana, a- imeshosha. Ama kuna mtu nata- kuna kuna mtu ameiva social lights wa US. Uh-huh. Unilete. Unajua natafuta next year t- next year niko na sina nafasi yangu. Social lights iko US. Ameiva. Unaona so, check mimi napiga ma Air Force man. Nini napiga low kuna check. So ule demo anajua anakuja anakuja class. Unaona vya harmonize analeta watoto wa kizunguzungu. Mm-hmm. Yaani mimi nataka mzungu, mkenya, nastaki kukataa wa Kenya lakini long last. Mimi tu mtoto najua main ni wa mkenya. Lakini wazungu pale ni kujinize. Huyu mtoto ni mpeleka. Ah utajinize. Sina mtu wa kuzalisha next year. Natafuta yani. 
Hapana, nimesema wewe uko nao kwenye simu anakuambia uende ufanyie interview. Uambie Mr. Boy uko pale. Mimi naweka tu pin. Ta. Kwangu. Unanielewa? Eh. Mr. Boy, hebu ambia watu wa subscribe kwenye Empire Group. Support support Savid is what it is to boy Mr. Boy representing 254 to the world and here it is Emba Group one of the baddest and the baddest cameraman and one of the baddest of the baddest people in the industry of the music King Trevor was supposed to subscribe channel ya Emba Group one of the expensive journalists one of the expensive uh, influencers one of the expensive gang Kindly, don't forget. Na ukikosa, Mr. Boy na raukia pale na muangazea followers elefu moja. Na iyo, godzea ucheki after my interview. Followers wanaangazeka. I love you, Empire Group.